Welcome everyone, I'm the balloon making guy and I'm going to show you how to make a great balloon in one second. First, I want to give you a safety thing. Balloons are a very serious choking hazard for little ones. Pretty please with sugar on it. Never, ever, ever give a balloon to a child if you're not going to watch it every second. They're a serious choking hazard. Now let's make a balloon. Okay, we're going to make us three flowers in a vase. To do that, you're going to use one of the 321 B-body balloons, and you're going to need three of the 260s, and you're going to need three pennies. What I will do is take my 321, stretch it open, put my coins inside of the balloon, blow it up, I'll let a little bit out. I want it about a hand width wide as far as I blow it up, tie it off. Now we're going to do the tulip twist, the apple here. We're going to take the knot, push it through. I'm going to roll up this part of the, the balloon here from the back end. And we're going to push them together. I'm pushing the knot through and I'm grabbing it from the back end here. You want to be sure and get it centered, and then we're going to poke it through about halfway, locking it into position. That's going to be our vase. Now we're going to do three little tulips. There's number one. Number two. And number three. To do the tulip is fairly simple. You take the knot, you push it through, you grab it here at the back, and then you're going to push everything halfway into the balloon, which is going to lock it in place. I pushed it through. I can feel the knot on the tip of my finger, which is inserted in there. Pull my finger out, give it a twist. I've got the knot here that I'm pinching onto. Then I push the whole thing halfway into the balloon. We've got one of our tulips. You want to be sure and push it through straight. If you get it off cockeyed, you, you, get, you get a cockeyed flower. But hey, Mother Nature doesn't always do everything in perfect lines either, does it? Okay. Flower number three. Push it through. I'll get two of them that are the same height and I do one that's just a little bit taller gives it a little bit more ornamental arrangement here I'll put about two fingers here there I want I want my stems to be about two fingers long then I'll tie my knot I'll bring it around all three fingers here I've got wrapped around three fingers ah. pull it through and tie me a good knot. And I'm going to clip the end. You want the air pressure to maintain there because if it loses the air pressure, the flowers are going to fall over. Give yourself a cut. There, I've got it about maybe a finger extended beyond the, the knot. Got my coins in the vase. The knot is pushed down towards the bottom. I'm going to push it up towards the top. I've got a little bit of the, uh, the this bee stinger thing coming through there. Push the whole thing in there. Let it go down, and you've got your vase. The coins allow it to to stay uh, stay upright, and it's a very fairly impressive balloon. Doesn't take that much to make. Hey, if you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Click subscribe. Yada. Hey, hey, y'all, take care.